WEG has built up such an amazing tradition that uh, the task is a little bit daunting, but hopefully I can make it work. You know, the tradition continues, I suppose. A drawing like the Premiership poster, you probably carry it all around in your head for a few weeks, you know, as it sort of goes from eight teams to four teams to two teams, who am I going to do? So I'm sort of, you know, conjuring up what magpies and bulldogs and cats and, uh, you know, these, these, um, these animals are going to look like when I put them on paper. When you actually sit down to draw it, that's probably the quickest part of it. It's the actual idea that takes all the time and sort of thinking. Well, I've been a cartoonist full time since about 1984. Uh, I got my first gig on the Australian Financial Review, which really didn't have much of a sports section. Uh, but Paul Keating was Prime Minister at the time, so I had Paul Keating to kick around. When I came down to Melbourne uh, at the end of 87, uh, on the Herald and then the Herald Sun, you know, I discovered this great thing called footy. I'd hate to see us lose our characters from football. You know, I say good on Juddy for the Kung Fu hold. That made a great cartoon. Uh, used to love drawing Barry, Barry Hall. Barry was given so many 50 metre penalties well, that day at the MCG that he actually walked back to Sydney. Uh, Fev, you know, he was always taking a leak behind the point post whenever he had a chance. Uh, occasionally I like drawing them for their brilliance, but I prefer to draw them on their sort of human frailties. I don't get to ride the horses as much as I used to, but I still ride. My wife Sophie rides, Daisy, my six-year-old daughter, she rides, uh, Jack and Elliot. Uh, I just suddenly realised my sons, my, my wife's a Carlton supporter, she named our sons Jack and Elliot. Can you believe that? I didn't even see that coming. How'd she get away with that? You know, working in the media, it's a, it's a pretty... Uh, non-stop sort of a job, 24 hours a day now, and um, I just needed somewhere where I could clear my head, and uh, you know, Tonnenbuck's a great place. When it's not on fire, it's very peaceful. How good is that? And we've got the, the horses and the chickens and the dogs, and the children can run wild, and um, yeah, we love it out here. Unfortunately, that egg didn't make it. <laughs>